Good morning, Steve's guys. Good morning. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make um, flowers with a uh, paper plate. And it's the little soft paper that's usually um, used for parties and uh, decorations, things like that. Um, I'm just taking my paper paper. My paper plate. I'm sorry, my paper plate. And I'm just, I'm just cutting strips of them. I already have some cut right here, but this is all I'm doing is just um, flipping my um, paper plate into small strips. But I'm going to show you how to um, make these out of flowers. And um, I also have some uh, nylon. Um, these are used mainly for tablecloths, but I just got got these and cut them into strips. They're they these are really really low price. So are these, but these are no more than a dollar. These are no more than approximately two for a dollar. I'm thinking, but I bought I got the color yellow, and this is how I'm gonna start my flower off. It's just like folding. I'm gonna I'm, I'm just gonna roll it. And this is the best way. I'm going to roll it until, and I'm going to roll it and roll it and keep rolling it until I form like a long stem. This is going to be the inside of my flower. My flower is going to look like this. Well, my stem is going to look like this. I know it really doesn't look like a stem right now, but this is the way my, it's going to look down, look long. And once I get to the top, you can make the stem as long as you want, which means that's how big your flower is going to be or that's how long your flower is going to be so i'm just going to take this and i'm going to roll it turn it roll it turn it roll it can you see that's all that's all i'm doing turning rolling it and going around and around until i get to my very bottom of my flower and then I'm gonna twist. It's real easy. The paper is, is so it's so soft and delicate. You can just twist it and your flower stays. Trust me, see? And you can open it out and, and maneuver it any way you want to. Well adjust I keep using that word maneuver. You can adjust this any way you want to. So this is gonna be I'm not sure if you can see this or not, but this is gonna be well this is a this is my flower. Uh, that's one of them, but I'm gonna I'm gonna mix these now because I like to um sometimes I like to mix and match. So I'm gonna take my um my tablecloth strip and I'm gonna take my paper crepe strip and I'm gonna combine them together. I don't know if you can see in that bit, but it's gonna look like it's gonna look like this and. Uh, together okay so I'm gonna do the same thing I'm just gonna roll flip roll flip roll flip until I have my stem so I have my stem and I'm gonna keep rolling again and I'm gonna turn make sure these are these are straight these are part like flat they don't have to be even but they just they just have to be the, together always they don't have to be even but they just have to be together and I'm gonna roll again and I'm gonna turn and I'm gonna roll again and I'm gonna turn and I'm gonna roll again and I'm gonna turn and I'm gonna roll again now this this is sort of a problem you're gonna have because the plastic um from the uh the tablecloth strip um, it's plastic, so plastic doesn't really very sit, doesn't really stay as, as, uh, good as the, um, and this, this is my flower. This is my gold and yellow flower, and I think it's so beautiful. And I just showed you how to make a paper crepe flower, a plain paper crepe flower, and a mixed one. So, and then it doesn't matter if my stem sticks out a little bit, but all you can do if it, you can just take it and clip it to wear it up. There we go. 
there we go so that's our flower so I'm going to try one more I'm going to try one more to make sure you get it because I want you to start making beautiful flowers for um see people this this will brighten someone's day you know I don't, I don't know about the I'm pretty sure you have a love a special love one in your in your life which I pray they don't get sick or they, they're not sick but this will be a, a big pick me upper okay you should remember what I said you have to keep them together they don't have to be even but they just have to be together okay I'm going to turn flip turn go turn and then flip and I'm going to flip again and turn and this is my bottom. I'm fisting the bottom because I'm done. Once you're done, once you, once you reach the edge, that means you're done. So that means your flower is complete. And there it is. It's my beautiful flower. So we just made three amazing flowers today. And uh, if you follow my directions, I'm pretty sure your flowers came out as beautiful, even more beautiful than mine is. And once again, I thank you so much for joining me. And you have a blessed day, and I thank you so much.